going on everybody? It's your boy Titanic Feet Jack and I'm back at you again with another video. Today we're going to take a look at the Air Jordan Retro 12, the Utility 12s or the Grind. But before we get into that, if this is your first time watching one of my videos and you like the content that you're watching, I ask that you subscribe to the channel. Also turn on those post notification bells. So you will be notified every time I upload a video right here on this channel. And I'm asking everyone that's watching to hit that thumbs up button, hit that like button and help the channel grow. YouTube promotes the video and get it out to more people on YouTube and I greatly appreciate it. Drop a comment in the chat, let me know what's happening with you, let me know where you're watching from and I will reply back to you. Now getting into today's sneaker, you see the box give you a look at that box tag the canvas focus will I'm gonna go ahead and read it aloud it says Air Jordan 12 retro color black black bright crimson US size 13 not my pair this pair is sold already and the retail price is 190 US dollars and you can see on the box on the side of the retro 12 boxes it has that caption like it always does Quality inspired by the greatest player ever. Looking on the inside lid, there is no lock stamp. It ain't plain Jane. You got your brown paper, tissue paper, almost look like that recycled stuff. And here we go. The Air Jordan Retro 12 Utility 12 or the Grind. Drop a comment below. Let me know your thoughts on this sneaker. Let me know, did you cop? Also, let me know how the release went in your city. In my city, every store did not get all of their pairs, so if you didn't get your pair for retail, be on the lookout in your city because you may have the same situation as well like I did. And I just showed you guys the inside of the box. There is no green and white sticker inside. Got both sneakers out. This is the Air Jordan Retro 12, the utility. That's grind. Yes, guys, we're taking a look at the Air Jordan Retro 12, the utility, or the grind as they call it. Looking at the upper, you have leather on your upper. This represents the Chinese sun. It's with the 12. These lines represent. We also call these the hood 12 because everybody in the hood loves the Jordan 12. We got a short grain of suede right here. You do get a little brush back motion, so it has a decent length to it. You have that infrared colorway right over your jump man plate, which is black as well. You got your black lizard print going on right here. That's on your upper. You got your silver hits right here on your eyelets, and you can see the Jordan jump man logos on here. Your midsole consists of black right here, your black polyutherane material, and you also got something new to the Retro 12. This comes from the This Is Trash line of sneakers Nike has been overloading us with, but you see that on the very bottom of your midsole, as well as parts of your midsole as well. It's made with 3% recyclable materials, and it leads to the outsole. You can see you have that on majority of your outsole but you do have your herringbone traction right here at the heel and toe in the black colorway also your white Jordan jump man right there and you can see Jordan's number right here two three in white and you have your carbon fiber as well heel of the sneaker number 23 right here in the white colorway and it's blacked out in that dark gray colorway anthracite you can see Jordan Quietly inspired by the greatest player ever. And you can see the Jordan Jumpman right here. Looking at the medial side of the sneaker, it's pretty much just like the lateral side. You have your leather material going up here and your Jordan Jumpman logo on your eyelet right here on the chrome eyelet hits. You got this short grain of suede right here with little brush bag motion your infrared line infrared 23 colored line right here 
and it does not say jump man on here like it does on the lateral side you have your lizard print leather right here on your midsole and you have more of that recyclable material which consists of three percent of recyclable material coming from the this is trash line like i said earlier i'm gonna pull the uh shoe tree out you can see the cardboard shoe tree if you will focus camera it says size 1314 you have your John Jumpman on here so it is nothing special on here looking at the toe box give you a good look at that toe box it's a decent grand of leather on here then you have your nylon tongue guys and you can see the two three the tongue is nylon but it's all it's like a thick nylon so to speak I think it comes from that uh, winterize line. If you had a pair of those winterize 12s, you may know what I'm talking about. But you can see the letters T, W, O, and 3 in like a smoke gray or anthracite gray trimmed in the infrared 23 colorway. And the jaw and jump man up top here. And those are on here in rubber. It's like a rubber material in the jump man and the 2 3 comes with these rope laces black rope laces and let's turn it around see if I can give you guys a look at that sizing tag US size 13 production date March the 3rd I'm sorry yeah March the 3rd of this year to April of the April 30th of this year so you have not long they did like a month and a half of production on these and looking on the inside you have that infrared 23 insert with the black jaw jump man on here and you got a sizing sticker in here size 13 and you have a black sock liner uh, let's check out the lace tips nothing special on your lace tips but that's pretty much the shoe in the net nutshell excuse me so comment below let me know your thoughts on this sneaker it's a nice sneaker in hand it actually looks better in hand than it did on the pictures but these were a pass for me easy pass but let me know what you think of this sneaker drop that in the comment section and i'm about to roll out but before i do like i always tell you if you can help somebody get a sneaker help them get that sneaker because you never know when it will be your turn to need help getting the sneaker i'm titanic feet jack i'm signing out